Oh, Pitawa. So, bro, how long have you lived in, uh, in Portacourt City? Okay, I came to Portacourt in 2014. Okay. And from 2014 to now, that should be approximately nine years. Okay, nine years. Yes. So, and that, that means you must know Portacourt City very well. Uh, uh, yeah, I know Portacourt City, but not because I'm not an outgoing person. I don't usually go out, but at, at least I have some things I know about Portacourt. I know. Okay. Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay, tell me like five things you like about Portacourt City. Whoa, Portacourt, get that one. When I done. Okay, Portacourt. Uh, Portacourt City is a. First thing I like about Portacourt is the fact that Portacourt is well secured. Okay. As a guy that lives in Portacourt, I know most times you go out and you don't get to come back early. And unlike other states, you can not move around or you cannot come back from where you are to your house at midnight. But Portacourt, you can actually go to your house any time of the day, any time of the night, midnight, 2 a.m., 3 a.m., 4, 1, any time. So any that time. means so the, 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 the insecurity that is uh, stopping the country right now is not affecting that person. Actually, it's not. It's not. It's not. But that is well secured and kudos to the governor. Wow. Yes. And the supreme being, that's God. Okay. Yes. Thank you. So that's one for you. Okay, that's one. Secondly, Portacourt is well serene. The serenity, the ambience, and people here are quite receptive. They welcome you if you welcome them. And everybody minds their business, so nobody <laughs> jokes oh, with nobody. Is, you must mind your business in Portacourt. Yes, now. Yeah, I, I, feel, I feel wow you say since I come to Portacourt, me and person never really get problem with that. Provided you are just moving on your own, you do your shit. The, the, the other person does his or her shit, so nobody jokes with nobody. Everybody they go align together, so Portacourt is cool. Third thing is Portacourt, they have good access road. Good access good road. Access, yeah. Yes, good access roads. Yes, I, yes, I saw that when I entered. Portacourt is clean. Portacourt is very, very clean. Yeah, I saw that very yes, clean. Yes, that's very number clean. three. Talking about access road, you can actually, okay, like where I live, initially going from where my 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 junction to the popular Wimpy junction, it used to take us about twenty minutes thereabouts. But since the governor built these flyovers and it has reduced the traffic, as we do, as we fondly call it, hold up. Yes. Yeah, you don't reduce the hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Uh -huh. So you can actually get to Wimpy about within 10 minutes, 12 to 15 minutes, thereabouts. So, yes, it helped. It helped. It helped. And the fifth thing is, you get another thing where I don't want to allow them. Because anybody <laughs> where you are, I'm going to actually want to test them. <laughs> what but, is that? What? Got I'm on no oh joke with that. God, that delicacy. <laughs> that delicacy, that part of the It's not the same thing with no, other... No, no talk, no talk, no talk. It's not the same thing at all, at all. It's not, it's not, it's not. Really? Yes. <laughs> Is there something special about it? To make a use in a layman's language. But I got people, they wash hand well <laughs> to prepare bole. <laughs> this plantain and fish, you. roasted fish. You need to try it. Oh, well, I will Maybe try I will invite you. Any of the festivals, Bole festivals, I go invite okay, you. Okay, so they do you, have a festival. Yes, Bole, Bole. yes, there is, there is this festival, Bole festival. It's, it's every year, every year. You come and enjoy. You see people, so many people around buying Bole, enjoying themselves. And you see celebrities, musicians come too. So that's it. Comedians, they come and enjoy, enjoy themselves. So that delicacy is perfect. I've not eaten it anywhere in Nigeria. Anywhere. Apart from the Potapop Bole. Yes, I, I know I've been to Imo State. I've been to, uh, uh, what is it called? I've been to Lokoja. I've been to Akwa Ibuma. No way. You know, test like their own. You know, test like Potapop Bole. Their own, they special. Uh, uh, that gravy, where did they, I don't know how did they mix them all, but that gravy, they add them with the sauce. <laughs> oh, what? Fish head. Tail. <laughs> oh, what? Don't worry, you can enjoy. <laughs> Oh, well. 
Okay, but uh, yeah, uh, apart from the bullet that you just uh, explained for all that bullet, is the best thing you can think of, the best dish you can think of in Potako City. But is there any other local uh, delicacy that they have? Yes, 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 yes. The thing is, bole is quite prominent in Potakot. Okay. Uh, there is this Calabari delicacy I enjoy so much. Okay. It's this plantain, they call it onunu. Mm. Onunu plantain. You cook it, pound it, and then with either native soup, the native soup that has so much gallops. Ah, <laughs> all these gallops. Yeah, you Obstacles, <laughs> plenty. Oh, yeah. ah, yeah, no play. road, road, no day there. If they find traffic, you need, you need to be there. You need to, you need to enjoy <laughs> that soup. So, perfect. Perfect. Uh -huh. That soup, oh, no, no, native soup. Uh, native soup. That is it. Is, is it only the Calabari people that prepare that kind of thing? I've, I know I've tested that from the Calabaris. I've not tested all that, but I, I know other tribes in River State, that got size, they have their delicacies too. But these are the ones I've, you know, I've tested. Very nice. Okay. It's quite tasty. That's cool. That's cool. It's, really, it's really a good place to But I got na jam. But I got na ma. No need, you need to try them. You know to say. Oh, but the top, the night, the night, the night life in Potakot. Oh. You can actually I know you can't really compare with the nightlife in Owe and some cities, but nightlife in Potakot is wow. It's, it's something else. Like in the festive period. I I I I, I was coming from uh uh, Oibo yeah. to Rumola at about 11 p.m. to 12 a.m. People were still at Pleasure Park enjoying themselves. Like enough crowd, the nightlife, light everywhere. So it's 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 welcoming. It's it it gives you hope that this city is lively. You understand? So yeah. it's it's nice. It's nice. It's nice. So, uh, like how much? Uh, can someone who is uh, coming to Stakot uh, to reside, or someone who the, the, uh, their company uh, 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 transferred okay. from another state to this particular uh, state? Yes. Like, how much will the person be budgeting to rent an apartment in Stakot? Okay, it depends on on what you want. <laughs> if you are, there are varieties of apartments. If you are going for a safe one, okay. If you are going for a bedroom apartment. Uh, and, uh, or if you're going for two bedrooms apartment. Okay. Like you, for self self contained. Self contained. Self -contained yeah. You need to budget. It depends on the environment though. Yeah. If you're going to Alo, Alo axis, that's Choba axis. Okay. If you're going to that axis, you need to Choba is not the Uniport. Uh, yes, Uniport. Uh, where you see the University of Patakot. So okay. there is where the university is situated. Yeah. You need to budget like 120, 130 there about. Okay. This one uh, for the rent though. Maybe for agency and the rest of them. But if you are coming to areas like Iwafe, uh, Ada George, Ajib, and the rest of them for safe con, con standard safe con, you need to put it like 170, 180, 200, 250. Okay. Some of the uh, some of the self con uh, you see them. Some of the self con, they are, they have water heaters, they have wardrobes, they have yeah, so standard, many features. Standard safe con. Standard safe con. And that's the safe one. And for you to get what you want, value for your money, you need to keep about 200 to 250 for you to get such standard of self content. And for a bedroom flat, you'll be budgeting 300. Yeah. Like yeah, Ewafair, Ewafair, Ada George. And if you go to Ajib, there are houses in Ajib. The bedroom flat in Ajib, you can actually get for 400, 450. Those are standards. Yeah. 250. Two, you understand? Yeah. It depends on yeah. the kind of house. Yes. Yes. And another thing is budgeting all this money. You, you need to bear in mind that the agent, 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 agents that will take you to the house, they have something. There, there, there is money allocated to them. There's an agency fee. Mm. And another thing, you know, say a Potakot landlord. <laughs> <laughs> if, oh, if, you, if you like, pay one million. That ten thousand, twenty thousand for drink money. Uh, you must oh, bring them. Uh, uh, I know good area. You must bring them. Some persons say even lawyers where they stay in charge of the, their houses. They, they get lawyer fees too. So, but but having said all this, Potakot is a very nice place to live. It's a very nice place to stay. So you can actually 
come to Kota Kota, you know, one of these days and cool down, relax, maybe for vacation, festive seasons and thereabout. Okay. Um uh, okay, if I'm uh, like someone who is coming to Kota for the first time, yes, uh, and you want a place that you can, you know, actually spend the night. Like, like hotel? A, yeah, it's a good hotel with good security. It joke. Oh my joke. It joke, it joke, it joke, it joke. <laughs> okay, Honestly, like it how joke. much will the person be? You know, looking okay, up if, if, if you want a very nice room where you can actually sleep and there will be no disturbance, you enjoy yourself, you enjoy your sleep. At least you need to budget from 15,000 and above. Okay. No, be say you no go see three thousand. Oh no, four thousand, five thousand. But oh, there, you know, say bed bug feed the. Yeah, understand. <laughs> no, man, roaches, no, roaches, roaches. You go to sleep. Roaches feed the lick your mouth. But then, <laughs> um, but if you if you if you if you really want to enjoy yourself while you come to Portugal, budget yourself very well. Keep like fifteen thousand, twenty, thirty thereabout. And there are expensive ones too. Uh, if you wait, fee carry you. Uh, you can actually. Go to if you don't visit Le Meridian. Uh, <laughs> um, okay, uh, Le Meridian. Yes, or you don't go uh, Presidential Hotel, Etelon Heights, and Swiss Spirit. Now your money go talk. Okay. Oka Ven too, very beautiful, very beautiful. I've been there. Oka Ven, sweet. So you could just sleep like newborn baby. But it's <laughs> on top of your money. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> on top of your money. That's really cool. Uh, but that call is really good. Uh, yeah, yeah. Spend some time. Uh, exactly. Uh, so there is something I've been, you know, um, meaning to ask you. Okay. So, what is the transport fare in Portaco City like? Because uh, for me, I've been in Lagos, I've been in other states, yeah. like from uh, Lagos. If you are entering from, uh, let me say, Dumota, yes, the popular market, yes. Dumota, yes, market to um, what is it called? Uh, uh, my two. Yes. Sometimes, maybe in the morning, you enter 200 or 300. So I don't know. Such a distance. Yes. <laughs> you know, so, if you see them for Portugal, they are do. Especially now, where inflation there on the high side, fuel price, everything, they like okay. this. And from you, you offer yourself, from you offer here to my, my three. If bad as you buy a driver, they collect 300. You know, you know they look at your face. If you, if you want to come down, come down. Say the person don't pity yourself, 250. 300 will they pay, you know, how you go do now? So, defer for other courts. From here to here, just to drive, I beg, I beg, I forget something. 100 naira don't come out. So, everybody, they look at your face. That one, mind you, everybody, they busy, they do business. So, defer here is kind of, uh, it, it wasn't like that actually, but recently, it changed. So, things now don't do anyhow. So, but, we they look up to God, Shah? No, 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 thing. Thank you. Uh, but, uh, like, uh, in Portaco City, uh, we have something like a, a, maybe a, a, a relaxing center or a recreational center that uh, maybe someone can actually take the children or people out, you know, to relax and have fun. Plenty now. Plenty there. Pleasure Park now. Na, 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 na. Now, Governor Weekend, uh, plenty. Governor Weekend, MP Pleasure Park. Uh. Okay, Pleasure Park. Oh, if you carry, if you, sometimes you go see children, they cry, they never carry them, go Pleasure Park. Na, na, na the course. Pleasure Park is. Mm, you oh. did a very nice job there. There are places you can take your children to, your kids. There are places you can, beautiful places you can go for re 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 relaxation centers. So many places you can go to spa, shop right. We just opened shop right in Portacourt. Yeah. There are eateries, enough, enough things you, you feed just feed your eyes with, get get your eyes stuck on. So Portacourt is beautiful. Nice roads, beautiful views. So many things. So many things. Now make your money to your pocket. Uh, yeah, okay. Yes. Money they better talk. soup, better soup, and money kill them. <laughs> so that's that. That's that. <laughs> no problem. Thank you very much. All right, yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Nice. Yeah, thank you.